Which are the best panels in One Piece? One Piece is one of those stories that if you're into it, if you emotionally invest in it, it will break your heart a hundred times. There's a handful of moments in the story that will move me to tears almost every time I see them, and one of them is in chapter 58. The chapter opens with hope. Sanji has a bit of food, he has rainwater to drink, he has split his rations, and he thinks that a ship is surely going to come soon. And from there, the chapter takes us through deprivation. The food stores dwindle, he drinks water to silence his stomach, he sits lonely on the naked rock, and he stares at the empty ocean. His last piece of bread turns to mold, the stores run out, and he begins to shrink and shrivel, his body eating itself from the hunger. It gets to be too much and he stalks up to Zeph, assuming that the old man has food stored away in his sack, and then he cuts it open and nothing but worthless gold spills out. Zeph gave Sanji the food, all of it, every bit, and he ate his own leg instead. When Sanji, horrified, demands of him why, why he would do this for a brat who showed him nothing but contempt, Zeph just stares straight at the horizon and simply says, because you had the same dream as me. And this is where I choke up sometimes, because, well, the chapter first of all explains why Sanji fed Gin, because he's been here. And it explains why Gin becomes so moved by that compassion that he cannot hurt Sanji in turn, because Gin has been here too. But most importantly, it explains how Sanji and Zeph can shout and bicker and insult each other with the brutality of enemies, but they are bound by bonds of unbreakable love, because they have both been here. But beyond that, Pay attention to Zeph as the conversation goes on. At first, his face is impassive and neutral, but see as Sanji begins to shout at him how the tension appears, the popping veins characteristic of emotions that are being held in check. You ate your own foot? That's right. You gave all the food to me? Yes. Why would you be so kind? And with sweat pouring off of his brow and veins popping all over his face, for the very first time, Zeph speaks honestly. Because you had the same dream as me. All the chefs and pirates we've seen so far laugh at the idea of the All Blue. It's an embarrassing thing to believe in, but Zeph believes, and now he's found someone else who believes in it too. It's after this moment that Zeph starts opening up emotionally. He tells Sanji about his dreams, his ambitions to build a floating restaurant, and he tells the kid to chase the All Blue in his place. He opens up and you can see that it's a relief to him. You can see how it softens him. He lays back in exhaustion and for the first time, he gets to show vulnerability. You had the same dream as me. And that is more precious than gold to a pirate, more precious than food to a starving man. You had the same dream as me. That's One Piece.